Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. So Takashi 69, Mr. Untouchable, Mr. I walk around and y'all can't do nothing to me. Yo, bro, I move so militant that you can't touch me. That's why I talk reckless. I talk so much because I know how I move. I move correct. Was caught lacking at an L.A. gym last night night now i can't show you the direct footage because youtube be tripping but we do have a very accurate reenactment let's go to the footage <laughs> finally i've been trying to catch you boys all day now that i've got you right where i want you Now, ladies and gentlemen, all jokes aside, not really. Um, Takashi69, if you don't know, let me just give you a quick rundown. He was somebody who had made a career off trolling a bunch of people, um, speaking about the dead, making fun of the dead, um, basically saying that this thing couldn't happen to him or it wasn't going to happen to him or why hasn't it happened to him yet. Be patient, Anakin. Now, I don't want to kick the man when he's down. <laughs> I'm just here to report on it. I don't really react to his music. I don't anything. I don't support 6 9 in any way. I actually hate 6 9 um, Rest in peace to Nipsey. Um, this is a teachable moment, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, nobody is untouchable. Um, in fact... Everybody has the opportunity. Here's a better way of saying it. I always say it like this. I'm not a religious person, as you see from my NF reactions. I'm not a religious person. But I definitely believe that you cannot put, uh, for lack of a better word, ugliness into the universe. And that doesn't mean like how you look and stuff. That means like the darkness. You can't put a bunch of that into the universe and not expect it to come back on you. Um, Takashi 69 was somebody who maybe thought the coast was clear, maybe thought people forgot about what was going on. Okay, everybody, coast is clear. But this is really what internet trolling will do to you. Takashi will never be safe. Takashi, it could be years. I mean, look at Alpo. Look at how long it took Alpo to get touch that a lot of people say had nothing to do with the rich porter stuff or who the band but that's just how the universe works now i feel like there's a lot of people who watch six nine and try to think that this is a way of breaking in the industry this is a way of um um um, um getting some clout but i mean is it really worth it stupid i mean look at this <laughs> You gotta ask yourself, what are you doing this for? Now, the whole six nine snitch thing. Like I, I don't, I don't even really care about the whole snitch thing anymore because the rules of snitching don't even make sense. Um, I think he foul, super duper crazy foul for what he did um, because that is the textbook definition of snitch. He actually sent people out on missions and then told those on those people. And then he got off. You gonna be in your crib or you gonna be with Sosa Hotel or something? Where you gonna be at? Yo, I got I got I got 30 pack room right now, bro. 30 pack. So I think it's crazy that we live in a system where you can do that. Um it's pretty crazy. But my biggest thing with 6ix9ine, a lot of people forgot, was his whole minor case. That's why I don't like 6ix9ine. The snitch stuff was just the cherry on top, honestly. Um, I'll never be a fan of him. And I'm not somebody like, do I celebrate the fact that this happened to 6ix9ine? Do I promote this to happen to 6ix9ine? Not necessarily. I more just say that this is kind of the circle of life. For anybody out there, this goes for... 
not just 6 9 This goes for like those uh, the internet prank people. This goes for those people like the like the boom gangs that were just going so crazy. Because even boom gang now is John Gabbana and realize what he did is crazy. That that type of lifestyle. There was a period where that was what was popping. You you had to be as crazy as you can, troll as many people as you can. And I'm gonna keep it tall. Um, the person who did this, the six nine, uh, looked like a Spanish. Uh, 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 what what's what's that guy called on the um, on Game of Thrones the 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 boulder the mountain he looked like a Spanish version of him I ain't gonna lie to you that boy looked like what oh my god uh I know six nine was what <laughs> I know he had the bubbly guts when he saw that dude approaching him you feel me and um, they took his pants too. That was just, I said, listen, 6 9 is a bad person. He deserved whatever, but you took his pants? Oh, that, we live in a wicked world, ladies and gentlemen. His pants? Oh, no, nah, man. Oh, uh, not the pants. And I knew they took his pants because he was in the gym with those hot pants, but he still had the full bubble on. I said, Listen, if he was going to come work out in the in the uh, in the uh Goldberg shorts, then I don't think he would have a full bubble on too, but he had the full bob. I said, "Oh, that's crazy." They did him filthy. So um yeah, I mean that's really what happens in this world. Uh you cannot put evil into the universe and expect it not to come back to you. 6 9 is not going to be able to afford to have security with him 24 hours for the rest of his life. It's just not going to happen. And what I think 6 9 banked on was, I don't know, people forgetting or, or people not caring. But that's not going to happen either. That's just not going to happen. There's always... And ironically... It's kind of the culture that 6 9 created that's going to keep people doing this. It's the whole clout thing. There's always going to be somebody who going to either do this because they want the clout or they genuinely have an issue with what he did or both. You feel me? And you ain't the president's kid. You feel me? <laughs> this ain't no Disney movie with Sim. He going to need Sinbad to protect him from now on. Facto. Now, a lot of people are saying, uh, why ain't this happened to Zimmerman? Zimmerman been walking around untouched, and I do agree with that because it is happened in Florida, and I'm pretty sure that's where Zimmerman is from and stuff like that. The only thing I can say to that is that Zimmerman didn't... Like, there are racists who protect Zimmerman. There are... He has, like, a racist fan base who will protect him and will support him, as crazy as that sounds. This is the, this is the world we live in. S the people who protected 6 9 he told on them. So he don't got a person who will lift a finger unless they're being paid. And what was messed up is, I'm pretty sure he did have a security guard with him in that video. So that's not even going to help you. You feel me? So, hey. Hopefully, you know, they sent him to the hospital and I don't know what he's going to do. If I was 6'9 at this point, I would just move to a different country, change my name, start making a different type of music. You feel me? I, I would do it because he's lucky it was just this. Man, that's it, I guess. <laughs>